I am really curious to see. What are you excited for, Lawrence? Knack three, no, baby. There's, a, there's not going to be a knack, Lawrence. <laughs> what do you mean? They got a they got a <laughs> PS5 Pro now. Mark Cerny's brainchild. When other time are they going to release Knack three? Cool. This is interesting. Man, I I loved what I played. I just I only played like three and a half hour, four hours of it, but loved it. It was great. It's about that the whole time. New bots. I wonder if they're going to keep up this kind of pace. Where every month they have a few new levels and bots to rescue. That'd oh, be that'd cool. be that'd be really cool. Neat. It's free. I really hope that format becomes more popular. The like platformer single player game that you keep iterating and adding content onto and patching, and it just has more long term sales that way. I guess if they charge outright, if they charge sixty or seventy bucks, they could totally get away with that. This looks cool. VR though. Well, uh, what, is it PSVR 2? Did you ever buy a PSVR 2, Lawrence? I have not. I have not tried it myself yet. I'm just, I'm wondering why it's in 21 by 9 and why it's like weirdly first person. I can't tell if, it, if it's VR or not. Are you a goth kid at heart, Lawrence? Oh yeah, there it is, VR. More of a new metal kid and I think, and an industrial kid. Industrial, so there you go. Goth. Yeah. Yeah, there's some goth DNA in there, but it's it's angrier and, and hornier, I think. <laughs> that looks cool. I like me a freaky little platformer. She said the country was Knack three, let the bodies hit the floor. <laughs> Be okay. Is this kill zone? Knack me up inside. That was neat. Scary AI robot. Oh, okay, we got a souls like on our hands. Oh, you're right, we do. I mean I like I like games with freaky imagery. I know, we were just talking about how you're a uh, industrial kid at heart. Yeah, there you go. Starring Glenn Powell. The hell of us? Neat. <laughs> the hell of us. Oh, Metro? Metro VR? Wow, two VR games. I think that sets a new record for the number of VR games in a state of play. I was going to say, I thought they'd given up entirely on PSVR 2. I kind of did too, yeah. Neat. Oh, Souls Man, Life. more action games. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. I hope it is hell an action. Yes, I, hope it's, I hope it's not like a Dark Souls, and I hope it is like an action game. It looked like there were multiple players running around inside of a town. Ooh, is there a parry? Are we gonna get a parry in here? Yeah, we need a bong. Yeah, no. <laughs> we got zombies and dragons. Oh my gosh, everything that gamers want. Archage. One. Of Archage Tronitrals. Maybe it's Archage. <laughs> From Cacao Games. Interesting. It's Archage and the hell of us. Oh, Power World. Man, they're gonna show off their. Uh, throwing boxes instead of balls. Man, after getting sued by Nintendo, the gall. I mean, they made they made a shitload of money. Yeah. Oh, that's a fun little shadow drop. That is, that's really cool, actually. Oh, Lord. Oh, Christ. You excited to play Lunar Silver Star Story, Bruce? I don't know what you're mm -hmm. talking. I don't even know. Are those, did you just say words? Lunar. Wait, she called it Lunar, not she Lunar. Said it, she said it wrong. No, Lunar Remastered. She called Lunar Remastered. Yeah, you'd think it's pronounced like that. I don't know. Maybe the 90s was wrong. <laughs> hey, I know Jay Kaufman. We met at a American filming of Game Center CX in Los Angeles. I, I still didn't understand any of the words you just said. I was back. Yeah, sorry. You're, you're getting like some deep nerd for me today. <laughs> I know, that's true. Is this a remake of Shadow? Just in time for the movie? Taking on another form? Oh, it's Keanu. Yeah, it is actually Keanu. Voicing in the game? Yeah, Keanu will do, he'll do, he'll do anything. Sonic the Hedgehog 3 movie pack. All right. <laughs> Lauren's trying to comprehend what they've made. Yeah, because I, I didn't know if it was just like a like one level or something. It sounded like they had uh, there was one line from Keanu Reeves and they used it. So yeah. <laughs> they just had a hot mic when he walked into the booth and that's what they got the rights to. Yeah. yeah. What's this? Papa Final Fantasy. He's he produced like all the Final Fantasy games up to six. Oh, OK. He's back, though. He's back. Fantasian Bruce. What's Fantasian? It's uh, it's an old school JRPG, but it uses photographed backgrounds instead of pre-render. So they basically built all these sets out of like paper and stuff and then photographed it. Oh, that's fun. It's turn based, but you like you store up fights in a little device that you have and then you fight through them all at once. But in doing that, you can like kill enemies really fast. So they found a way to sort of minimize the amount of time you spend in combat. Mm. I'm excited for it. It was it was trapped on Apple TV for a while and they're finally porting it. Oh, weird. <laughs> yeah. This is moving really fast. I just mean the showcase in general. All the oh, trailers. yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm glad you're interested. Oh, you haven't been in? Yeah, I guess this is all pretty deep weeb shit so far. Yeah, this Portable is like JRPGs. the deepest of the weeb. Flouncy. 
like Devil May Cry style action RPGs. The action RPGs are actually interest me very much. It's the uh, like the the like Lunar and Fantasian, and I'm like, man, mm -hmm. we're good. How wide is your Dragon Age character's head going to be, Bruce? <laughs> oh my god, I can't wait to make the ugliest thing in the world. Oh my gosh, a dragon! I'm glad they're showing it though. They should. Yeah. There's gonna be a light dragon and a dark dragon and a wet dragon and a dry dragon and an earth dragon. Torius the Ice Talon. Yep. And a lightning dragon. Nacho cheese dragon. Hamburger dragon and a pizza dragon. Pizza dragon could be a force for good. <laughs> Spooky release date. I can't wait. I'm really excited. Is this new DLC? I think it is. Oh, looks controlly. It's what we all knew already, but it's yeah, cool. Yeah, even, even more than the original Alan Wake, but, or Alan Wake 2, rather. Cool. It's Mr. That looked like Mr. Scratch, but it was a new Scratch. Somebody else. Oh, Hitman VR. Oh, nice. Oh. Yeah, I've been meaning to try this because this looks really cool. Yeah, it does. Oh, you can snap people's necks in VR? Fantastic. <laughs> Surely you can piano wire somebody. You can do everything that I think the game allows you to do. Fantastic. Yeah, because it's all fantastic. weapons. Yeah, all of it. Oh, that was sick. Oh, man. He blocked it with a frying pan? Shooting the guy around the corner? Oh, man. It's our guy. You know him. Raziel. Jack, Jack, Jack and Daxter? Who? Yes. Jack Who's and Daxter. Who's Raziel? It's that guy. The guy without the jaw. Oh, is this Legacy of Kane? It is. Oh, okay, so it's... Okay. It's not a remake, then. Uh, okay. They showed a little bit of a remake there. <laughs> Just a little bit. This is a pretty, uh... Pretty quick brush up, then. That's not like a fully redone lighting and everything. Right. It did, it did a lot of cool stuff. When a lot of games weren't doing cool stuff like that on okay. console, but a lot of games have since then. So. Right. Oh, right. I played this a little bit at Play Days. I'm excited yeah, you, for this. Yeah, I was curious about this. I think the uh, like the game uses light as a mechanic, uh, but I think it's also part of the themes. You're kind of like a, a nerdy girl mm -hmm. who's trying to learn to be okay being looked at and all that kind of stuff. But the main character is asthmatic, so when you get scared, you start like doing the labored breathing. And that makes it really stressful. Cool. Powers of Agazba. Every time it always reminds me of when we made fun of. <laughs> we're like, uh, up next, pull Tabby Slew. You know, like just some random word. <laughs> Towers of Agazba. You're like, cool. <laughs> Shadows of Umbaba. I know. <laughs> there it is. Towers of Agazba. Oh, it's like, somebody sneezed. Oh, Lego Fortnite. Lego Fortnite. Oh, look at him dance. <laughs> oh, another Fortnite news. Fortnite controller. Oh. That costs $80, probably. Fucking banana man dancing next to an $80 controller. <laughs> yeah. Again, this like third person action games. They sell very well. I want to play Dynasty Warriors. Dynasty Warriors feels like a game I would really enjoy. You might get bored. Oh, really? Oh, okay. Helldivers is kind of similar to Dynasty Warriors. It's just like kind of like a numbers and attrition game and yeah. then you're sort of mashing out the same combo over and over but is it so it's not fun <laughs> that can be fun <laughs> co-op is pretty cool oh those horses were just knocking dudes up into the air that was pretty cool my chat said dynasty warriors is not fun <laughs> there you have it then yeah it looks it looks cool but you're saying it's boring okay it's repetitive yeah it's repetitive all right yeah but maybe the graphics will like make the the glitz Stick out for a little longer this time. Yeah. Only PS5, huh? Well, hmm. Yeah, probably. It's another dragon. Oh, that a, was that a, no, this is Monster Hunter Wilds. I actually got to play this at, uh, I played this exact section at uh, TwitchCon. How'd you feel about it? It was fun. It's Monster Hunter. Was there a new monster that was suspiciously similar to human genitals of any kind? <laughs> I didn't see any. Uh, there were some really cool quality of life things that I didn't, maybe I hadn't noticed in other Monster Hunters. There was like a, uh, you hop on your your little mount and basically just press a button and it would chase the monster automatically, which I don't remember, but I guess maybe that existed already. I don't know. That is super nice. Yeah, I, it just didn't feel like something I had used before, so. I sure haven't. Oh man, there's gonna be cutscenes? Yeah, there was a bunch of cutscenes in the stuff I played. We, I saved a life, Florence. I was a hero. Oh Lord. I can't wait for anime characters to shriek at each other for five minutes and then I have to beat up a big penis monster for 20. <laughs> Monster Hunter's great. I think that was their big finish. Oh, we got a date. Okay, all right. Was that the last thing they're going to show? All right, PlayStation Studios, here, here we go. go. Oh, a... come on. Oh. Uh... Lego Horizon. Fuck out uh... of here. Uh... Uh... 
They haven't even really done the rumored remaster. Is that going to be their one more thing? Oh, God, it is. Oh, <laughs> almost Bloodborne, guys. We almost had it. Oh, almost Bloodborne. I think that's... Is this the end? This might be the end. And Aloy has more good news on the horizon. Ah! Oh, Aloy, Aloy. More good Don't news. Don't do it. Don't do it, Sony. Finally, it's what I've always wanted. I'm so glad they remastered Ten this video hours game. of conversation. Lawrence, they got a hit on their hands. This is it. Uh, and, this sucks, man. And don't forget, it looks the best on a PS5 Pro Anniversary Edition. All right, all right, all right. What? $10. Ten dollars. Ten dollars, huh? Visit PlayStation Blog for more details. No sale, Sony. <laughs> I never finished uh, Perfect picture with Horizon. Poses, I didn't either. Maybe if it had re-recorded dialogue. Come on, just put Stellar Blade on PC. What the fuck are you doing? Right? Yeah, they said they're working on it, I think. Oh, they did? Okay, all right, good. Man, oh man, that's what I want. I want <laughs> fat asses. <laughs> well, you're about to get them. Damn. You better be careful. 2B is a, a dick annihilator. <laughs> oh, boy. Time for everybody to play Legacy of Kane and have the worst time of their lives. Go for it, people. Oh, Last of Us. Wow. Finally. Wow. So that's only on premium or extra. Okay. Uh, they're remastering Horizon, Bruce. I know. Isn't that awesome? It's what we all wanted. I saw so many Reddit posts about how they wanted it. <laughs> New controller! It's sparkly. And it's only $80. And you can't replace anything in it. Not <laughs> even the battery. Hi, Mark. We recently reviewed Love you. The newest edition. Love you, buddy. PS5 Pro. Some of you motherfuckers said it was too expensive. <laughs> and since I'm a millionaire, it doesn't matter. Get fucked, nerds. Since we heard you, we're raising the price. $750. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> you should raise it out of spite. Yeah. Get wrecked. No, wait, is this Ghost of Tsushima 2? <gasps> Our expansion, maybe? <laughs> Ghost no, of Tsushima they're, remaster? They're Son of a bitch. On, Not a remaster. Working, they're working on two. They're working on two. Oh, that'd be great, though. I, I mean, we're not going to get a date for it, but... Ghost of Tsushima? <laughs> nice. Yeah, it is. Oh, it's like all Western theme now. What is this Fucking music? Fucking awesome! I can't wait. I guess samurai movies and Western movies are the same thing. Oh, they totally are. Yay! I knew they were working on this, but I'm still really yeah. excited for it. Rad. Absolutely rad. One of the best open world games ever made. I'm so excited. Agreed. Yeah. Wait, do you have a wolf companion now? Maybe instead of killing the wolves. Aha! I knew it. <laughs> I knew it. Cool! Ghost of Yote! Sick! Classy. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, we got a chain? And a year. Oh, and oh. a gun! Sick. That's next Sucker year. Sucker Punch right. still makes games. Good for them. You bet they do. All right, that was rad. That was a great one more thing. That was a good way to end this. Thank God. Thank God. <laughs> they needed it. <laughs> I don't think anybody... Like, I didn't hear a peep about a new Ghost of game, so that's pretty cool. They actually managed to keep that one all locked up. I had been... I just heard rumors that, they, that Sucker Punch was working on it, but... <sighs> now, that's a good reason to get a PS5 Pro, because Ghost of Tsushima looks so good on PC. Right. You're absolutely oh, right. Oh, man. Yeah. All right, we got the second game. We did it. They have two now. <laughs> well, at least they will next Wait, year. What's, the, what's the first one? Astrobot? Mm-hmm. Astrobot. Ghost of Yote. Astrobot on PS5 Pro. You gotta spend seven hundred dollars to play Astrobot. Well, if you want to play it with PSSR, and you do, <laughs> you do.